Welcome back everybody, Bakuzilla here, and today we're back for another Bakugan unboxing and review. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at Ventus Talon. So, take a look at the box. We have Talon's character art. Big Bird Man. Kind of reminds me of Moltres. Uh, there he is in the packaging. Stuff you get. More stuff you get. There's his render, Geogon opening, and then more Geogon you can buy. Anyways... I'll be back when I have them out of the box. So here's everything out of the box, starting off with the cards. The gate card here is Orlis Treteris with his Baku gear uh, in front of the moon. Looking pretty cool. Uh, 700 Pyrus, Ventus, and Orlis, and minus 200 Aquas, Chaos, and Darkus. We have Talon's character card. Ventus Talon for four energy at 1700 B, two attack, and plus eight attack on Helix. This is pretty good, uh, four energy for a 1700 boost and B power. You're pretty much gonna beat everything. Not a lot of things can reach 1700, not even some of the newer stuff. Even if you have a Bakugan at 1000 B power landing on a magic shield, that's not gonna beat you. So yeah, pretty good card. You can even like use some energy cards after that if you do have the energy. So, uh. Yeah, not too shabby of a Geogon. And then here we have Sonic Scream for 5 energy. It's plus 10 attack and search your deck for a card. Um, you know, for 5 energy is pretty high already, but is the max I'd say you should use uh, for like a, just in a deck. Because over 5 is already getting to like turn 6, and that's pretty late game. So, yeah. Uh, I mean, my deck is an energy creator creating i'm not sure what to call it but it, it makes a lot of energy so i opted in to put in more expensive cards in there because of that so you know if you want to use that and you have an energy creating deck then go for it anyways here's the geogon talon in his box form i guess here at the bottom good focus thank you yeah, he's just a box. And then to open him, which way is forward? This way is forward. And, ba da dun! Again, his character design reminds me of Moltres, a green crystalline Moltres. He looks pretty cool, though. I do love all, like, the, I guess, plumage. The claws look cool. Yeah. Pretty neat looking Geogon. And it's actually pretty cool looking too. Because you got the claws here and then you got that big poofy tail. Wish they kind of painted it a little though. Um, yeah. Wings look nice. The head sculpt. It's okay. They have this thing back here for some reason. You can put a... Uh, what is it? I can't... Uh... Baku gear on it, that's what it's called. Yeah, it's pretty cool. The way you close them, so I can remember, you fold in its head, squeeze them in that little spot there. I'll put this in, wings, and then you close that up, and there you go. There's his B power. Yeah, pretty cool looking Geogon, and that's really all I have to say about him. It's outro time. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.